Moses, we finally got over the line. How delighted are you to be a Hull City player? I'm just happy things, things you know, finally got pushed through today. You know, and it's been delayed for a little bit, but I couldn't, I couldn't stop what was happening behind the scenes. But I'm just happy everything's gone the way it has. Uh, take us through how it's happened. Then, when did you first learn of the interest that we had in you? Um, I found out just before my birthday, which is always good news, and um, took some time to speak to my representatives. And um, I made a decision that I wanted to obviously leave Brentford Football Club, you know, to sign for a, a bigger club. And um, that's how it came about. And what did the manager, Steve Bruce, have to say to you to persuade you that this was the right place for you? Um, he just, like, he's, I've played against Hull a couple of years now in a row. And he said that he's seen me from there. And he was just kept reassuring me that, you know, this is, this is where I should be. And he believes in me. And that was all that persuaded me. I think he said it was while you were playing for Leighton Orient against us in the Cup a couple of seasons ago that he first sort of took notice of you. Do you have recollections of that game? You must have had a good one that night. Yeah, I remember all three, which is funny enough. And um, on the day, you know, I thought I put in put in a good shift, you know, and, and it caught a few eyes, which helped, which helped me a lot. And your career has sort of been on an upward curve since then, hasn't it? Yeah, you know, touch wood, it's been, everything's been falling into place perfectly, you know, and, and last year, last year was a great year, even the year, years before that, you know, and I've just got to keep going and this is another, another stage. Because last season you were in the Championship with Brentford, flying high in the division, hopefully it'll be the same again this season with us. Yeah, fingers crossed, you know, the, the ability here on paper is, is ridiculous, so, you know, I think if, if we all put our, put our heads down, you know, and get on with what we need to do, find ourselves back where we, everyone wants to be. Yeah, in terms of your own personal strengths, what, what can we expect? Um, a, lot of, a lot of attacking play down, down the right side obviously of the pitch and hopefully I can add a few more goals if I can here and there to help the team and a lot of assists and mainly defending to be solid at the back. And of course you've had pretty much a week to settle in already, how have you found the rest of the lads and the training and everything? You know, credit to them, they've been They've been top notch, you know, like everyone's made me feel welcome. Like if, if I ever needed anything, people just said just pick up the phone and, and call. We'll let you know where all the nice restaurants are and whatnot. So no, it's been good, credit to all of them. Now that it is all signed, sealed and delivered, do you'll just be looking forward to the season ahead? Yeah, I'm thankful that it's that it's all gone through now. Unfortunately I won't be able to play tomorrow, but I'm just looking to go, get ready to, to play, which is whenever I'm chosen next. So you be in the stands tomorrow cheering the lads on? Yeah, I'll be there to watch. Thank <laughs> you.